another secret to our happiness has been revealed. This time, apparently, it's keeping a diary. However, we must only write down the little things that have cheered us up each day. Liam's actually giving me dirty looks here. Why? Dirty <laughs> looks. Well, I'll wait till you end. Because... Go on. <laughs> I've seen you. What do you do it? <laughs> I do. I think, and I think it's a great thing to do. So basically, it's called a gratitude journal, and I have it's called it. Called what? A gratitude journal. Right. And every. <laughs> <laughs> Every night before I go to bed, I write in it, and the girls do as well, we write in it the ten, ten great things about the day. And, you know, sometimes you go to bed and you kind of think, oh, I've had an awful day. When you kind of force yourself to do that, you realise, actually, you some know, some, some... Yeah, and, and you appreciate it. I also walk around with a gratitude rock, which I told Colleen about earlier. <laughs> <laughs> and what did Colleen say? <laughs> I've got it here, and I keep handing it to her. And I'm very <laughs> grateful for it. <laughs> <laughs> and it's just, it's just like throughout the day, just to remind yourself of what you're I'm grateful for. I'm going to leave for. that on my husband's pillow tonight. <laughs> 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 Gratitude. So, so, so what, do you, what do you do with this? It's just, it. it's just like a simple reminder to, to, to remain positive. And I know people might think it's quite arty farty. Janet, but you can't. <laughs> <laughs> dog poo, I must admit. <laughs> the idea of having that in your handbag... I mean, I do keep a diary and I've kept uh, diaries off and on over the years and I do think diaries are really, really therapeutic, so I'm not going to poo-poo mm. the idea of you having a diary, but writing ten great things that happened today mm. might not be the ten most interesting things that happened no, Isn't it just a load of banality? Can, like, someone can, smiled at me, I felt great. You can be happy great. for that. You, you can be happy for that. And Ooh, I know... What kind of record know, are we going to have no, in no, a hundred no, years' time? <laughs> Of Jamelia. I'm, I'm going to no, no, no. it's got to be full of smiley faces. <laughs> I don't think... I, I definitely do not write it for that. It is purely for personal purposes. But, you know, people might laugh at it, but some people do require that. Yeah. I mean, um, yeah. I, even myself, I've been to the doctors before and, um, and they've prescribed me d antidepressants. No, and I actually made a conscious effort. No, I don't want to do that. There's got to be another way. And for yeah. me, that's my other way. Yeah. Yeah. I know yeah, it might sound it? weird. Yeah. Well, well the, the guy who came up with this whole idea, I'll give that back to you. Mm. Give it to Janet, see if you can get a smile Come on her. <laughs> <laughs> see if she's suffused with joy and gratitude. Um, but the, the guy... I do quote pebbles, but I don't write gratitude. No, I didn't write the guy who it. said, you know, this thing about, you know, keep a diary and mm -hmm. write the things uh, mm -hmm. that, you know, have been really nice in the day, he says you can train yourself to be happy, yeah. which is quite an interesting idea, because, you know, depression mm -hmm. is a yeah, major issue, um, you know, at varying <coughs> degrees. Do you think you can train yourself I to be happy? I definitely think you can. I mean, when you've had... You know, I remember in my worst moments, um, you can either lie there and go, woe is me and poor me, and there was times when, like you, they mm. put me on antidepressants yeah. and all, I thought, I don't want them. And I've got to say, for the first month, everything was forced. I forced myself to get up, I forced myself to shower, I forced myself out the house, mm. and it was hard. Mm. But you know what, gradually it just became... Habit. A, a, a habit, and all of a sudden I thought, actually, I'm enjoying this. Yeah. But and that was yeah. me retraining my brain to go, you know what, it's not all woe is me. Yeah. I did write you know, a diary during some really uh, dreadful times in my life, and also when I was really angry with people, and I do think that if you're angry with someone, either a relationship or a job or whatever, and you write it down in a diary, the good thing is that a lot of it is utter bilge. So you <laughs> write it, and you're really angry every night, you write it, and you remove this poison from your brain mm. and you place it on the page. So yeah. I do agree that writing a diary is Which very... Which is now the size... Yeah. Um, yeah. See what everybody else thinks. Janet's it's keeping... the size of an encyclopedia. <laughs> <laughs> and rising above that, <laughs> 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 we have pebble back. Where is it? <laughs> <laughs>